what a dream to be here in LA with you. Yeah, man. Look at that backdrop. It's so beautiful. That's a that's CGI right there. What are you talking about? <laughs> that's not real. <laughs> such good, such good effects. Yes. Um, another insane film. What is the thing you most look forward to when you wake up and you go, "This is my work." I most look forward on this film for people seeing how we carried uh, Paul Walker's legacy on in this movie. And a lot of people don't know that he was about 80% done with the movie before, you know, we, uh, before his untimely death and us having to shut down production. And this movie almost was not completed. So I'm just very thankful and, and very happy the way that we creatively, you know, made this happen and finalized this film. I think you did it really beautifully. I yeah. was in balls of tears when it ended, and I have to say, yeah. I urge everyone to see it, but for those reasons yeah, in particular. Um, uh, so there are some incredible fighting scenes, like uber, uber, uber. Uh, what are your three top tips to throw a really good punch? <laughs> uh, to throw a fake practice. Make sure you get it right. The angle on camera is extremely important. And then always being the first guy to throw the punch. It always helps, as opposed to being reactive, getting hit, and then trying to hit back. Have you ever accidentally been hit? No, no, but I do remember Tyrese. If you if you haven't interviewed him yet, you have to ask yeah. him about gun butting somebody accidentally on Fast Five. He'll tell you about that. Our first day of shooting, hit somebody with the butt of a damn gun, and they were bleeding and everything. And all he said, all he said was, "Oh, damn, my bad." <laughs> 